Hello everyone, welcome to the February 2024 GWiz Community Showcase. I'm your host, GWiz, and I asked you, the viewers, to submit your best projects to be showcased on this channel. Here we will be showcasing the top 5 projects this month in no particular order. Without further ado, here's number 5, Slime Slayer. Slime Slayer, created by Michael Dev, is a simple yet polished game. The whole point of this game is to shoot endless waves of slimes until you die, trying to beat your own high score. This game is available on itch.io and will be linked in the description down below. At number 4 is Gorf. Gorf, created by Cryptix, is a simple game inspired by whack-a-mole. You play as a frog where your main goal is to collect as many flies as possible until time runs out or you get eaten by this bird that gives me nightmares. This game is available on itch.io. Speaking of giving me nightmares, at number 3 is The Warehouse. The Warehouse, created by Matt Coonway, is a horror game where you traverse an eerie warehouse where you must complete objectives and avoid numerous anomalies. This is a very in-depth game with multiple enemies, tools, difficulty levels, and easter eggs. I highly recommend this game to fans of the horror genre. This game is not yet released, however it's available for wishlist on Steam. At number... Wait. Z's not a number. Hey, have you heard of Zenva Academy? They offer easy to follow game development courses for a wide range of developers. Whether you're a complete beginner or you know a thing or two, Zenva Academy will have something for you. Zedva Academy offers structured learning pathways for those looking to learn Godot, Unity, Python, and much more. You can unlock all these courses with just one subscription. Zedva makes learning both fun and practical. You'll get professional video tutorials, written lessons, and interactive quizzes. Plus, you'll work on real projects, building games of different genres such as FPS, RPGs, and open world. For a limited time only, if you use the link in the description down below, you'll get 20% off your subscription. But don't wait long, it's only available for the first 100 people to use the link. Thanks Zenva Academy for sponsoring this segment, now on to the rest of the video. At number 2 we have Floopy. Floopy, created by General Tanitz, is a survival game still in early development. Like other survival games, you can collect resources, fight mobs, build bases, and deal with the impending doom that is death. Floopy is still in very early development and is not available anywhere. And last but not least, we have something a little bit different. And that's Pathfinding by Quartiox. This is a simple pathfinding visualization app made in Godot 4.2. It has the options to use either DFS or BFS algorithms to find the optimal path. Anyways, this has been the first ever GWiz Community Showcase. Comment down below what your favorite project was. And if you're a developer, submit your project to my Discord where it can be potentially shown in the next showcase. Comment down below what your favorite project was. Anyways, I've been GWiz and you've been you and no, I don't know why I'm yelling.